You'll never guess who came back. What was that? Okay, I'll try again. <clears throat> um, greetings. Today is truly an auspicious... Is that the right word? I don't know. Jack, come on. <sighs> Poltergeist can't get a decent introduction around here to save his life. <laughs> you know what I mean. I've missed you. Of course he did. <laughs> Jack, I think we should talk about why you left. Of course you do. I'm serious. I think that's the first real thing you've ever told me about yourself. Am I just supposed to pretend like it never happened? Oh, can you? That'd be great, thanks. Jack. Fiona. If you want me to meet with your dad. And tell him what? Oh, hi. Your dead son's been living in my closet for the past couple of months. I can tell him anything you want me to. I don't want you to tell him anything. Not... Just... Not yet. I still have to figure out what I want to say to him. I only have one chance to get this right. You know? Until then, maybe we should go see that movie about the thing and the people at that place. Okay. But I'm not buying you popcorn this time. Oh, but throwing it at people's faces is the best part. I'm not spending $13 for you to be mean to innocent moviegoers. Well, maybe when I get a job. Whoa. Job? I don't know how I feel about that. It's just until I can start selling more art. Like, really selling it. You know, Fiona, something I really admire about you is your dedication. Thanks, Jack. The dedication to the delusion that you'll ever be anything but a starving artist. Emphasis on starving. Well, Tabitha thinks I can do it. Oh, well, if Tabitha thinks so, then... <laughs> hey, have you made out with her yet? Jack! What? I was just wondering. Jeez. I'm not talking to you about this in front of images.